Lunch shaming is when a child has no money at the cafeteria or their parents owe money from previous meals. And they are either given a cheese sandwich or nothing or a stamp on the hand or an embarrassing letter and sometimes even having to clean up the cafeteria before they can eat. It really is an accurate term to describe a debt collection process whose sometimes whose purpose is to shame children because it's effective. The way food aid is distributed is really um, is racist and, and, and leads to a huge amount of inequity and makes people who need food, which is a basic right and a basic need, jump through incredible hoops and prove they're poor every few months and it's a humiliating an exhausting exercise just to get your basic needs met. The Mexico Appleseed, I founded in 2009. It is part of a network of centers that were started by the 1958 class of Harvard Law School who wanted to do systems change work and they wanted to do it at the state level and they wanted to have a ripple effect with whatever they did with their pro bono resources. The Hunger Free Students Bill of Rights is the law that New Mexico Appleseed wrote that said that no matter what a child owed, to the cafeteria, no matter what their parents owed, no matter if they had money that day, that they would get a full healthy meal and not be stigmatized in any way, shape, or form, and that the debt collection process would be between the adults. So I spearheaded the whole effort. I named the bill and I co-wrote it with the legislative council and we found a sponsor and we pushed it forward. You cannot solve problems for other communities. You, what you have to do is be the vehicle for helping them solve the problems themselves. But I think there's really now a movement to get meals to all kids for free, and this is really one of the first times I've heard multiple states considering just paying for students to eat.